somebody will steal your thing and say, go to the court. That is a level of ridicule according to Joe Ajaro. Welcome to the news and please subscribe to our channel. The president of the Nigerian Labour Congress, Joe Ajaro, has warned the judiciary against compromising the election petition tribunals following the concluded 2023 election. Wala Masele. The NLC president speaking in a press conference on Sunday stated that the acronym go to court being used recently is disgraceful. He said he alleged that somebody steals something and then demand that a person being robbed should go to court. He argued that basically the thief is saying there is no hope in the judiciary. He stated categorically that judiciary has the chance to redeem itself and to rescue Nigerians as well. They said, he said, the acronym go to court these days is now shameful. When people tell you go to court, they're telling you that that's the end of the matter. Somebody will steal your thing and say go to the court. On what basis are these statements used, being used? That is a level of ridicule that the judiciary has been brought. And as Nigerians, we all need to come out to rescue the judiciary or else there will be no need to continue to go to court. And I'm telling you, it is 100% correct. Was it this one talk my day correct? You say that acronym go to court. Now just there you say, That is what it means. I come now, come your house. Do you anyhow. Beat you black blue. For years, you not do anything. Just because I can do that. I am a bully. I come to your house, bully you. And after beating you, I go tell you, say, if you go feed you anything, go to court. Maybe my papa and I be judge or... I am just saying my, my sister and a lawyer. So I will tell you, go to court. You understand? That means there is nothing you can do. There is nothing. That is what it means. And people who are saying, eh, they are insulting the judiciary. Now, nah, APC, now nah, starts the biggest, now nah, give the judiciary the biggest insult of the century. Now, nah, APC. Yes. You do person waiting no good. You can't see open matter. The person say, make the person go court. Excuse you. Excuse you. What thing you they do? What exactly are you doing? What thing they saying? Gone, 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 gone. What you they do? So if the Nigerian, if the judiciary won't redeem itself now, I tell you, they will have to do what? They will have to do well. They will make sure that people will say them go court next time. Before you go talk, go court. You go use your tongue, count your teeth. It is going to be that almost the judiciary will not go take them lightly. You know? Now that is my this is where I even uh, where the appointment of the judiciary should be checked. You see all this way they hear eh, the judge decision is appointed. They should find another way where they are going to be electing, maybe. Maybe electing. Because if you're elected into a position, nobody will come and tell you, say, ah, you know, say Nami elects, you know, say Nami, Nami put you here. Oh. If they appoint you, if they know Nami put you here, oh, you know, say Nami. Oh, Oh God, this person and my brother, they yeah, make you behave well. But if you're elected into that position, based on your merit, based on say you know your onions, you know work, then I don't see why you're going to be scared. Anything, you can do it. Anything. I advise Uncle Joe that you should leave policies to the politician. If you want to succeed as a labor leader or else you'll burn your hands, my honest advice. Well, this advice, upon say the pain, no, the pain. I, I like as in commerce, I can't give in two cents. But as Nigerian Labour Congress leader, leave these people alone. Leave these people alone with their matter. True. But I know say it concern all of us. You go, you know, get us, you go be where we say, you know, go talk. Hmm. I crave for a Nigeria. And I know a lot of us crave for that Nigeria where we are not going to feel threatened anymore. We don't go feel threatened anymore. Go to cause, go be, we are going to get justice. You understand? He doesn't need your advice. The Labour Party was bred by the Labour Union, so he has the right to defend it. <laughs> mm, I'm just saying, Sha. He can voice out, he can give his own opinion, but he should not go too deep. I know what I'm... I understand the angle this person is coming from. He's a Labour Party leader. I mean, he's a Labour Congress leader. Then go for straight up. <laughs> You know, I don't understand what I mean. They go for straight down. So, I'm not saying he don't have the right, have the right to speak. But in our country, we say things they go upside down. If you talk for this country, if you talk truth, they go they, they go on, they go on, they go be like they use knife kill you. So people go if their eyes not knife safe gone, they go not murder you finish. All right. Mm. Why Nigerians are this? You just want this country to continue like this, even when you're not enjoying it. 
you're always against anyone speaking the truth. Well, he's not, the person is not. Look, the person is actually coming from the place of caring for the Labour Party. I mean, from the Labour Congress leader. Listen, let me read the, uh, what's it called, opinion, uh, the person's opinion to you. He advised Uncle Judah that you should please leave policies to the politicians. If you want to succeed as a Labour leader, you understand where this person is coming from or else you burn your hands. You understand? This is just, he's not saying, of course now, as far as we're Nigerian, you can come out, you can give your two cents. But make your two cents as a labor leader. Make it be two cents. Make it no pass. Huh? Labor has the opportunity to rescue Nigeria from this political thief by shutting down the economy if the judiciary fail Nigeria this time. My dear, only if Nigeria is a sane country. In this country, they're not send anybody message. If you decide, say you won't shut down the country, and at that time, then go use money, blind some people. And I'm not going to blame them. That's why I say poverty is really, really a bastard. I'm telling you. I heard the amount that they used to bribe the, what's it called? According to, uh, what's it called? Newzo, they used to bribe a certain politician, $100 million. I think this thing go up. I say, oh, boy. This is generational lifting out of poverty. Ah, I say, oh, more. See money. Just imagine that man, they can't carry that in me. Oh my, see my children, they go swear for me. If they yes, they give me one of them, I don't call, I don't call it time. Eh? You understand? People are human beings. And Nigeria, whether I would like it or not. Oh my, Nigeria, they hot now. Things, things, things. Get us things be. Okay. I don't think this is the man. This man is the president of Nigeria Labour Congress. He said he's struggling to take the chairman's input of the Labour Party. Equally, he's obedient by nature and character. Well, are you savvy? This is what other regions are afraid of, giving us succeeding power to the East proper because of their ego and pride. They can misuse power to do anything. Ajero, the president of Nigeria, but is a least most says to know how far the book can misuse power. I don't understand way to. I may say make the man no give in two cents, no me say the man no talk at all, make I clear some people. He has to come outside to even talk, I like him. But I'm saying he should not go deep into it. But you coming out to say him coming out to voice his truth or give his two cents or opinion on a particular issue where we say come sign him as a Nigerian that it is now him coming out to be biased. Omo, um, you are getting it all wrong. Okay. The APC using their crime go to court if you have stolen your victory because they know they have actually stolen your victory. And they're telling you that because the judiciary has become a place of ridicule where a financially stronger person or person or an entity with authority will win a case because of their influence or position. And it is very bad. This is bad for our country. If you want this country to move forward, there must be justice. And for justice to be done, the judiciary must remain neutral. All right, on this note, you have come to the end of the news. We say thank you for turning in to listen. Until I call me away next time, enjoy the rest of your day.